hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you how to add and remove items dynamically into a list box control in Windows application I'm adding some values Charan Vijay Ben now I'm deleting the item from the list box control. I want to delete Vijay remove. See, the Vijay item has been deleted from the list box control. Ban remove. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. For this video tutorial, I'm creating a new Windows application. Go to File, New Project. And from the Windows template, I'm selecting Windows Forms application and the .NET framework I'm using 4.6.1. The application name is dynamically add remove list box items. Click OK. And here the project is successfully created. Let me expand this form on design page. Now in this form one design, I'm adding one list box control, one text box control, two button controls and one label control to display the message. Let's add the controls. Go to toolbox. The list box control. Let's add the text box control, toolbox. text box control go to toolbox I'm adding one label control press F4 I'm deleting the default text of the label 1 go to toolbox again and this time I'm adding button controls F4, I'm changing the label of the button, add, and second button control for the remove. Press F4, remove. Up to now, we have just finished the designing part. Now, the coding part. Double click the add button control, it will generate the button click event. The first condition if text box one dot text is double equals to string dot empty. If a user clicks without enter any values in the text box control, I want to display an error message in the label control. Label one dot text is equals to Please enter some text in text box. And I want to display this message in a red color. Label one dot four color is equals to system dot drawing dot color dot red else in the else part I'm adding the items in the list box control from the text box control list box one dot items dot add and this add method takes the object here the object is a text box one dot text let's add that one text box one dot text label one dot text is equals to add an item plus text box one dot text and I want to display this in a green color I'm copying this label color 
in the green color that's it this is a code to add the items dynamically into your list box control let's check the results start and here we got the output let's check the first condition if the text box is blank and I click add notice I got a message please enter some text in text box control so let's add some value charan add see the charan item is added the next one ben add and notice in the bottom the label control added item is ben now my next step is I want to delete the selector items from the list box control these ones I click remove I want to delete this Ben from this list box control let's finish the rest of the code stop debugging here I want to add in the add a text box one dot text once the item is added into the list box control I want to clear the text box control so switch to the design mode uh, this time double click the remove button control the code is list box one dot item start add with remove at remove at this remove at method takes the integer which is the index value so here I'm adding list box one dot items index of object value the object value is a selector item in the list box control so list box one dot selected item that's it we have written the code to remove the item from the list box control let's check the result start I'm adding some values Sharon Vijay Ben. Now I'm deleting the item from the list box control. I want to delete Vijay remove. See, the Vijay item has been deleted from the list box control. Ben remove. That's it.